Hey guys, it's Monday morning and I'm going to start working on this major project of getting my doll shelf set up. Um, the theme is going to be like spooky witchy dolls. So, so far I have my Integrity Toys doll in here. Um, I think I'm going to leave her on the top shelf, but I'm going to start going through my closet. Alright, I have my little step stool here so I can get way up here. Okay. So I will show you some of my treasures. I'm not sure if all of these are going to go in the case, but I'll have to kind of decide and see what there's space for. But these I got because they were my favorite toys as a kid. These little mini Aladdin dolls. I just have Aladdin and Jasmine. This was definitely one of my favorite toys I ever had <laughs> growing up. So this isn't the one that I had when I was younger, but I, I rebought them off eBay because mine were disposed of long ago. Here we have Dubby. And then all my Harry Potter dolls. I'm not sure if I'm going to unbox and display these, but I have Harry and Ron. Um, I might just stick with the witches. So I have Hermione in her signature ball gown. Ginny Weasley. Cho Chang. And Luna Lovegood. So I'm definitely going to debox the girls and display those. I think those will look really nice on their own shelf. Um, I have a Disney doll here. I'm kind of trying to keep the spooky and um, witchy theme going. So I'm very excited to free her. It is Sarah from Hocus Pocus. Isn't she cute? I think that's going to go really nice with all the rest of these. And I don't know if like my Aladdin dolls are totally going to fit the theme, but I mean, it's magic, magical. Fairy tale, I don't know. I might end up replacing the, the Aladdin dolls with something else eventually, but maybe for now. And then I have, let's see, one of these are open. This is uh, Monster High Mattel doll. Greta Gremlin from Gremlins 2. Let's see if I can get this off. Ooh. How cool is that? Very on theme. She's so pretty. This is the Beetlejuice set. Also Monster High. And we have two dolls in here. 
Beetlejuice and Lydia. I got Sarah out of her box. I'm really impressed with the level of detail. Um, she has these cute little bloomers on underneath and she's very well articulated. I mean, I can like fully bend her knee, her ankles, her hips. I mean, she can swivel this way on her hips, her arms, her wrists, her head. Let's see. Seems to just turn. Yeah, super cute. Her hair is very like glued and crunchy, so I might wash her hair. Um, look how cute her little cape is with this hoodie, witch hoodie. It's very flowy. Here she is next to my Integrity Toys doll. So she is quite a bit shorter. Um, maybe I'll get a little riser for her to stand on. I don't know, does that look weird if she's much shorter? I do like her being on top though, she is one of my favorites. I got my Harry Potter Witches Unbox, so I will show you them. Here's Ginny. She's wearing the classic Hogwarts uniform. Her hair is a little greasy. I don't know. I think I might wash it. It's very soft, but I, I do think it needs to be washed. Um, and her jacket, it's kind of stiff and not the greatest material or cloak, I should say, but I don't know. Maybe I'll like just kind of display it off to the side. Here is Luna. She's pretty cute. Um, I think I'll leave her hair in this side ponytail, but yeah, she has this cute jacket, little buttons. I'm going to keep her wand attached to her. Here's the shoes. And she comes with her little glasses and let's see a copy of oh, the quibbler and then the last two are from the yule ball so they came with these little plastic invitations i don't know how i feel about these i think they could have done something cool with just like a little punch glass or something um but here's cho she's very pretty her dress is kind of basic, but it does have this cute, like, embroidery type of lining here. These are her shoes, just very basic. And Hermione looks a little rough. <laughs> her hair is just very glued and a little bit crazy, but I'll see what I can do with that. Um, she has the same shoes as Cho, just in the pink. Her dress is gorgeous. So yeah. Oh, I don't know if I should... Yeah, I think I'm going to take this rubber band off her hands. Here we go. So she has one kind of regular hand and one hand that can clasp around something, so... There she is. I got them in here on the second shelf. They're on these pink Kaiser stands that I still had laying around, but yeah, I'm still gonna have to fix some of their hair. But this is what I have for now. It is now later in the day, but I have it where I'm just going to keep it for now. Um, it's going to be a work in progress, but I just have these two up top, her little accessories. My Harry Potter dolls are right here, and I have Hermione over on the 
the side. I don't know if I'm gonna leave it like that or if that looks dumb, but like, I like having some facing this way and some this way because my kitchen is over here. So I don't know, I'll have to figure that out. And I still have to figure out if I'm going to debox them or just leave them like this. And I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with Greta yet, but for now, I just have them here. And for now, I just kept these in the box as well. Um, but I do have, I don't know if you can see it on there, like a bunch of Jasmine dolls and Aladdin dolls. I don't know if I'm gonna display some of those down here. So I, have to, I still have to figure this all out, but for now, I'm just happy that they are out of the closet. I can actually look at them and enjoy them. And yeah, I'll figure out how exactly to display it and if I want to add things or subtract things. Let me know what you think. Um, this shelf is called the Detolf shelf. It's D-E-T-O-L-F. And I got that at Ikea. Um, it's the same ones as what I used to have years ago, if you've seen my older Ever After High collection video. Um, I moved multiple times since then, so I had to sell those off and I'm just, I'm excited to have one again, you know, and I have a very tiny apartment now, so I really can only fit one, but that's good because it just makes me kind of be a minimalist and, you know, really choose my favorites. So I'm happy. I hope you all have a great day, a great week. I'll see you again soon. Bye.